Postal Redux is a remake of Postal. It strives to offer the same feeling that the original offered, but with better graphics, better audio, improved gameplay, and adds additional game modes. On paper, I really like this idea, because not only does this bring more attention to where the Postal series started, but since the original game is free, this is a great way to give back to Running With Scissors. In my opinion, Postal is a masterpiece in horror, and it does deserve more attention. However, Postal Redux fails to accomplish its goals. The store description uses the word faithfully, and that's a fucking lie. Postal Redux fails to capture what made the original so great. It has no edge. So, let me explain why. The loading screen art is completely changed, and not for the best. The original game's loading screen art had a realism feel to it. Observing the lifelike corpses and horrific scenes really made you feel uncomfortable. Postal wanted to make it feel close to the real world, that's why it was so disturbing. They even did this with the promotional material. In Redux, they went with a new art direction and it feels cartoony, and any sense of horror is now gone. In the original, the outskirts loading screen art was remarkable. The corpse hidden on the ground, almost merging with the path is a great detail. Combined with the blurry background, you feel panicked. What are you seeing? What is happening? It fills you with dread. In Redux, they added Shadow Cool Duty figures! There's no longer a hidden corpse in the path! So much for horror. Was that supposed to be faithful to the original? Because, uh, I don't think so. It's pretty dull, it's pretty lame. For additional comparisons, here are the Chot Stop and Parade of Disasters loading screen art. Now, you may say that the quality overall isn't bad in the Redux loading screen art. True, but for horror, this is more. The lower quality in the original enhanced the horror. Redux suffers from being too clean, too crisp, and it's not dirty enough. In addition, some of the loan screen art barely got a remake treatment, such as the farm. Now, that kind of makes sense because the farm's one is so amazing. Also, whoever thought of including shaky cam in the loan screen art, fuck off. The effect in the original one was actually kind of calm, but it wasn't distracting. Shaky Cam is fucking distracting, and it's pretty cringe. Let's move on to the sound. In my opinion, the sound design in the original Postal game is just as important as the loading screen art to make the experience horrifying. Without it, Postal wouldn't be Postal. It was demonic. It was both alien-like, but at the same time so human. That's why it was scary. It was humanizing Postal, dude. A monster. My personal favourite is the city. It is pure screaming agony. It's loud, meant to make you feel constant stress. Is this the postal dude screaming? No one can scream forever. It's a powerful trap. In Redux, they nerfed it and the tone is gone. What happened to the scream? It sounds like whistling. You don't feel the stress. There is no human element to it anymore. It's really underwhelming. Bite my ass, that's not faithful at all. And what makes this even worse is that Vine vs. Scissors even used some of the old soundtrack for Redux, such as the construction site and the industrial complex. It's it's like, why? So much for remake? Jesus. Like, it, it's lazy. It's actually lazy. And, like, it's not even on the official OST on their YouTube playlist. Yeah, we noticed that, by the way. You thought we would notice that? Yeah, we did. And it's like, it really does question the whole faithfully remake deal. Like, so much for a remake. Is this a remake or is it just a rehash? Like, I'm getting mixed feelings! Now, now, before I go postal. In Redux's defense, they mostly tweak the sound design for the other levels. And it's alright. It's harmless changes. And to get this out of the way now, the Rampage OST is legitimately great, and mixing it with the abstract sounds is such a genius move. I love it. However, this does come at the cost of breaking the horror tone completely. I mean, if there was any in the first place. <laughs> now it's time to talk about the ending. I've already made a little video about the ending changes. To be brief, Postal's ending was disturbing, but at the same time, it humanized the Postal dude. It's incredibly powerful. Redux is one. Kinda captures that feeling, but it's less memorable and it's less impactful, and really forgettable to be honest. There is a valid reasoning why they changed it, but it would have been neat to remake it and use it as a hard mode ending. What captures how Postal Redux lacks horror and edginess is comparing the menu screen to the original. In the original, it was a demonic roar with an human mouth that could be screaming for bloodlust, or it could be in a massive, massive agony. In Redux, there is no demonic roar but a guitar riff, with a mouth that looks so cartoony, 
It looks gross. That's really it. Also, what is the tone trying to be? Is it trying to be like a badass, like, cool, juicy, epic action moment? Last time I checked, the Postal Dude in Postal is a monster. The last words I would describe him as is a badass. It's just so conflicting tones. For fuck's sake, even the credits removed the baby from the original. Yes, the baby's corpse is conflicting with the ending since Postal Dude doesn't harm kids, but it was still really, really upsetting to see a baby's corpse with the others. It's edgy. I guess Redux wants nothing to do with that. Pussy. I have been Heather Critical of Postal Redux. However, it's not all bad, and I still believe you should buy it as a way to give back to Running With Scissors since Postal is free. The new level they added, the carnival, is impeccable. The sound design and the loading screen art is just mwah. It fits so well in the world of Postal. It does have some horror to it. The central part of loading screen art and sound is an upgrade to the original. It's so good that this alone, in my opinion, is worth the price of the game. This is a faithful remake. Oh my lord, the sound. The sound is so good. It's my comfort music. I cry listening to the central part soundtrack. It's just so incredible. And if I had to rank it, it's the best one from both games. That's how good it is. And wow, whoever was in charge of this deserve a raise, holy shit. The expansion levels from Postal have returned with new soundtracks and even new loading screen art and they have been made faithfully. Nice! The gameplay itself is way smoother. Yes, it was shit on purpose in the original, but I'm not complaining, it's a nice change. And as mentioned before, the Rampage OST is slick. And that's really it. Postal Redux is not a bad game but it's no way a faithful remake of Postal. It has no edge. It has no horror to it. You know what's amazing though? Postal is free right now. You can play it right now for free. I appreciate Run of Scissors to allow others to experience it. And for what's worth, Postal Redux brought a ton of attention to the first game, to where it all started. And I think that's great. If you want to know the full story of Postal 1, I made a 3 hour video about it. Link is in the description. What? You don't sell Postal?